Welcome to the Financial Doctor Show. Hi, welcome to the Financial Doctor Show. I'm Nick, your host. Today, I'm going to revisit about life priorities since many of you asked me to explain again why is life priorities, Nick? Okay, I'm going to give my own example. I'm married, I'm 45 years old, I have one child aged 11 years old, a daughter. So, what are my life priorities? Well, okay, I would like to buy another property. I want to go to Hutch in another 10 years. Okay, I would like to retire when I'm 60. Uh, yes, of course, my daughter is going to college in another four years. All right. Okay, maybe we take that. those are the example. All right. So then I need to plan all these life priorities uh, from now. Right? If I want to buy my property uh, in another two years, if my daughter is going to college in another five years, if I want to go to Hajj in another 10 years, all right, and I'm retiring in another like 15 years, well, the closest is about my buying my property. Second one is my children's education. So I've got to decide, all right? So uh, yeah, what are the decision that I've got to make is where to put my money first. All right, but somehow I've got to put some for all these priorities. I've got to put some here, some here, some for my uh, property, some for my student education, some for my hajj planning, some for my retirement. I cannot put, uh, I cannot do only one or and neglect the rest because my all these life priorities and my age are actually going on at the same time together. <laughs> So uh, that is about life priorities. Uh, you may have other life priorities that you would like to do at the same time. And yeah, as you go on this life priorities also, you would have other things to do like going for a holiday, you want to buy shoes, bags, your everyday life kind of things, or all those. So in a nutshell, all right, to conclude all this, you see, life priorities uh, the major things in your life that you would like to achieve that you've got to uh, plan, uh, put aside money, you've got to track uh, when are you going to uh, need it, right? So these are the things that you need to speak to a licensed financial planner so that he or she will be able to advise you holistically, all right, uh, how you are able to achieve your life priorities by managing your financials, by making sure that you don't make financial mistakes along the way, by making sure that whatever money that you save is intact, is not, will not be used for other things uh, other than the life priorities itself. All right, so I hope this explanation uh, made you understand better about life priorities. So till we meet again next time, bye. Thank you for listening to The Financial Doctor Show. You can find the show notes and links on our website, mypf.my slash financial doctor. Subscribe, like the video, and don't forget your financial doctor appointment next week.